Hey guys, John Thompson, Spring Frame Art Guru here. Today I'm going to take a look at a bean creation exception when you're auto wiring things in spring. This is a pretty common exception and you, you need to take a look at it a little bit closer because it does throw out a big stack trace and it means different things. There's con there can actually be a number of reasons uh, behind this, but in a nutshell, spring is saying I'm trying to create this bean uh, but I can't I can't find the uh, dependencies for it for whatever reason and you got to look into the stack trace to uh, take a, a deeper look at that so I have an example here where I have a hello world controller again and this time I'm putting in a hello world service okay so I have my controller I have an interface I'm coding to an interface like as a, a best practice in the spring framework and then I, I have a typical spring boot application I'm going to run this real quick and show you the the error that we're getting. So we can see that it's nested down here, but I'm getting no such bean definition. That's actually the root cause because it can't find a, a bean of that type. So remember, Spring by default is going to auto wire by type, and in this case, I have the Hello World controller, and Spring is seeing that okay because if I look, I, I do have an annotation here for component scan to look in controllers but that's the only package he's going to look in and so if I come in here and even if I do create a new Java class and I'm going to implement this uh, interface Okay, now I have an implementation of that, and if I run it again, we're still going to see an error. Okay, so same thing, still not finding it. So uh, another reason is because I mentioned the component scan. We actually need to uh, expand out our package. So now I'm going to scan that service where that, that implementation lives. And this is a common error. I've done this. We're still not finding it. I'm like, okay, I got the concrete application or instance there. I've actually doing a component scan in the package. The problem is I have my interface. I have my, my implementation of that interface, but I forgot to put in an annotation on it telling it that it is a, a component for Spring. So now when we run Spring, that we can see that it, it got uh, got the bean okay and it ran normally without an exception. So, so I want you to remember a few few things here. When you see that bean creation exception, there can be a few different things wrong. For some reason, Spring is not finding that type that you've declared, and it, it's going through, it's looking for it. But you might have a problem with your component scan. You might not be declaring the bean as a component or a service using the annotation. Or if you're using a Java configuration, maybe you've mis uh, labeled the bean there. So. There can be a few different reasons at play. It's some kind of investigative work when you see this exception, but the root cause is that being a spring is trying to create a bean for you, and for some reason it cannot, and you need to do further investigation about why it cannot do that. And look at the exception uh, stack trace. It's going to tell you exactly what it's looking for and exactly why it can't wire up that bean.